please help me welcome a day from Jell. Thank you. I'm really excited to be on the Verge stage uh, pitching Jell. Uh, as he said, I'm Ade Alano. I'm the uh, co-founder and CEO of Jell. Um, I'm also the founder and uh, chairman of Formstack, uh, where the story of Jell starts. So Formstack is a company that's based here in Indianapolis. Uh, we're over 10 years old. Um, and really, Jell started as a solution to some problems that we were facing as we were scaling as a company. As you can see, we started out kind of small. It was just me for the first year and a half at Formstack and then slowly added a person here, a person there. Uh, and really, the first five years of Formstack's existence, we were less than 10 people. Uh, we've really scaled up to over 70 people over the last five years. And really around uh, this inflection point in, in uh, 2012, where we were about 10 to 20 employees, we really started to have to put a lot more process in place around communication and management. Um, and uh, we happened to have a hack week uh, late in 2012, and the dev team put together a simple app to kind of help facilitate daily stand-ups so that uh, they could check in via this app rather than have to meet every day face-to-face. -face. Uh, and this little tool is what uh, ended up getting adopted throughout Formstack on every team, marketing, sales, et cetera, and became kind of a core part of how we did business at Formstack. After a few years of that, um, really looked at that and said, you know, hey, we've got something here. Let's productize that and uh, focus on that with its own independent team. And that's how Gel got launched uh, and, and how it grew. So I was really excited to work on Gel, not just because of uh, it's a, a way to solve problems that we were seeing internally, but for the last few years really had thought a lot about the reality that the nature of work is changing for all of us. Some of this is uh, you know, shifts in process or culture. We're a lot more agile, uh, distributed, bottoms up. Uh, some of it is technological. We're, we're much more mobile as a workforce. Uh, and then we're also seeing shifts in how we work because of things like Slack. that's completely dominating how we're, we're uh, talking to each other internally over kind of traditionally using email to do those things. And so really, Gel came as kind of, you know, out of this thought process. Um, with this and also the problems we're seeing at Formstack, really, uh, Gel tries to solve some core problems. And if you boil it down, as a manager, I've always really struggled with like answering that question of what's everyone really working on? Are they working on the right things? Uh, you know, are we going to hit our goals? Am I, am I doing the best job a, as a manager and getting that information and really making smart decisions? As an employee, I always struggle with, well, am I working on the right things? What are other people on my team working on that might affect me? Uh, and really, uh, when you get down to it, the way we've solved uh, or answered a lot of these questions in the past is like, let's have more meetings. And I think we all know that that's not the real, the real uh, answer to it. And as you're scaling as an organization, it was really clear to us at Formstack that you know, getting, having more and more meetings and having more and more people around the table going around the room saying, here's what we're, we're working on, really wasn't the right solution. So we built Gel. Um, simply, there are two core uh, pieces to the, the Gel platform. The first is really uh, helping you answer that question of, what is everyone working on? So as a manager, I can go in Gel and set up a way for my team to check in daily or weekly and really answer key questions around, you know, what am I working on? What problems am I running into? Uh, you know, what did I accomplish recently? This can also be used as a way to really set an agenda for one-on-ones and really have more, you know, uh, direct conversations with employees. Or it could just simply be a place where you uh, team members share metrics or wins for the week and things like that. And it's all kept in gel. And as a manager, I can go in and have all that information at my fingertips. And then furthermore, we have a very deep integration with Slack and native mobile apps for iOS and Android that make it really easy for team members to check in and for managers to have all that information readily accessible. The other core component of gel is uh, a platform for uh, companies, teams, and individuals to share goals. This really helps transparency within the organizations so everybody knows what everybody's goals are and what they're working on. Uh, and then uh, it also gives a process for updating progress on those goals. It really helps with uh, accountability and focus because not only can everybody see how I'm progressing against my goals, but I can also tie my day-to-day -day activity to those long-term goals to give context and kind of focus. Um, and so really at the end of the day, 
as a manager, if I know what everybody's working on and I know how everybody's progressing towards their goals, I'm really much farther ahead in building a more effective team. And that's really what we're trying to do with Gel. Uh, so quickly, uh, the history of Gel is, you know, as I mentioned, we had kind of that internal product at Formstack. We launched an MVP uh, called Flock about a year and a half ago. We actually relaunched uh, in December uh, under the name Gel with a much more robust platform, uh, which has all the functionality you'd see if you go on the site today. Uh, and uh, we've really been able to, thankfully, grow organically to have teams at, at some stellar companies. Uh, you see their logos up here. Um, and uh, continue to grow it and build out the product. Uh, Gel right now is a wholly owned subsidiary of Formstack, uh, but has a small team of three people we're actually hiring. Uh, we have a, a role posted right now, so, so soon to be four, uh, and working on spinning that completely out of Formstack. Uh, and uh, finally, uh, you can head to gel.com to sign up. We have free accounts that you can use, uh, or if you want more functionality, you can upgrade to one of our paid accounts starting at $4 per user per month. That's it. Nice job. Sharks. Todd, will you kick us off with some, some questions? I would love to. Uh, fantastic, by the way. Thank you. You mentioned a Slack integration. How does Gel complement or differentiate itself from workplace tools like a Slack or like Basecamp or others? Yeah, so uh, the way I see Slack is Slack is really great at real-time communication, you know, chat. Uh, Gel really focus, focuses on, on that structured communication and kind of, you know, organizing goals and plans and progress. So we actually have uh, about 80% of our active users integrate with Slack, so they use Slack to publish. They publish uh, basically what they post to Gel to Slack, and you can actually update everything on Gel from Slack with using uh, slash commands and stuff like that as well. So uh, it pairs really nicely. Awesome. Great to see the platform. Um, so most of my workforce is a distributed workforce, and remote workers really struggle with this balancing act of having multiple applications, multiple platforms right. to, uh, to work through the communication. So what really makes Gel essential for that remote worker to, to make them successful? Yeah, I mean, uh, basically, it, uh, and similarly, a lot of our users are, have distributed teams or remote teams, and the, the value they get from that is really uh, at the start of each remote person's day, checking in via gel to, to share what they're working on or what uh, the coming day or what they accomplished the day before. And so it adds more structure to uh, kind of that process, whereas if you're all, you know, if you're a small team all kind of in the same room, Maybe you could get that information more ad hoc or just you know, kind of through uh, chit chat. But as a remote worker, you're, you feel more disconnected. So it's even more, that much more important to be structured in the way you communicate. We have time for probably one or two more questions. Well, I was actually going to leverage a question kind of off uh, John's, which our company is more centralized. Mm -hmm. um, expanding in field yeah. offices, but uh, most of our workforce is not distributed. So how much or what type of success have you seen in non-distributed workforces? Yeah, I mean, it's really been a mix. I'd say our, our uh, sweet spot is if you're growing as an organization or similar, you know, similar to the story I shared with Formstack, once you get beyond you know, 10, 15 people, you can't all stand around in the same room. You know, it's the two pizza rule that Jeff Bezos you know, preaches that uh, once your team grows beyond that, then you really need to focus on more structured communication and process to really be more efficient with that. Uh, so yeah, I mean, we, we have plenty of users that are all you know, in the same company, but you know, once you're 10, 20 people and, and up, you really need process around that communication. Uh, Five-year broad brushstroke vision. Right, what, what's, what's awesomeness in five years if uh, everything goes as planned in your head? Yeah, I mean, it, it, it goes back to kind of our core mission. Like, we want to help build more uh, effective teams and think that Gel really is, you know, kind of one of, one of a set of products that uh, will really be uh, kind of a dashboard for managers and teams to do work in the modern era. And so that's, that's really what we want to accomplish with Gel. Want more secrets from inside the minds of entrepreneurs and innovators around the world? Subscribe to our YouTube channel here and click the link below. We'll send you our best interviews and strategies for growing your business.